long enough? I think so, yeah. No, the shoes. No. Very, very good set here. Ooh. Every Saturday on 10 a.m. EST, we do an NA versus you fashion contest with the best people coming with the best fashion to uh, compete against each other with a 100 gold prize pool overall. 50 for NA, 50 for you. If you want to participate, definitely join our Discord to see, for example, what the schedule is for this month. This was February's. Definitely go check if you want to join and, of course, follow the stream twitch.tv slash turns with us. And let's get into this week's fashion contest. First, we'll have EU. Cat Yeller. Interesting pieces. Eastern colors. Who is this character? Look at that. With the Skyport weapons. Nobody uses these weapons. They look pretty cool. I like how everything in your set is like made out of like blades. You know, you have your blades, you have your feet blades, you know, like hidden blades there. I'm think I'm pretty sure that there's a piece like a like um I, I um I ha some hands that are exactly like your boots right here. But I'm guessing that it would not work because they would be too bulky compared to the rest, right? That being said, I think this looks nice. I like the little ears as well. I think it's uh, I think it's good. I think it's a good set. Wow, this guy. Did I tell you to come back? This, oh, this set is so good, bro. Like this, guys. I mean, honestly, look. A for effort, okay? This is actually, you know, look. They, they, are, they have the colors. You know, they do have the colors. The blue, the golden, the armor pieces do look kind of similar. -ish. They even have the lion uh, show uh, hands and boots. You know, having the lion is the um, the animal of Stormwind. Um... So in some ways, I guess they do. The only, as I said, you know what? I will, yeah, I will allow it. I will allow it. And also, you have to, you know, the only problem I have with this is that, as I said before, I think the infusions are a bit too much. I think if you just cut, honestly, every infusion here, it would just look way so much, so much more better. So much better. It's a good set overall, and it is some sort of, uh, it is some sort of um, cosplay. So, you know, I, I appreciate it. I think it's good. Here it is. The Slenderman! <laughs> it's Slenderman! Oh, that's so cool. That is actually... Oh, oh, it is becoming bigger as well. Just as slender as the Slenderman. This is actually very good. Because, you know, you have the suit. As the Slenderman would usually have. Right? The Slenderman. If you guys don't know what it is. And, of course, you also have the tendrils on the back. Uh, oh, and he stealths as well in order to get you. From the uh, yeah, you have the um, the backpack with the tendrils, like the Merce um, like with the Merced backpack. I think it's perfect. I like the you know the fact that you went for um, Savari as well to make it look like you have the you know the the white face with nothing on it. Uh, and uh, yeah, I really like it. I think you make it. I think you made a good job. And the tonic to make it bigger, very good job. I think it's good. Very very good. Very very good. Okay, next one, Lily. Of the abyss. Hmm. I mean, is this supposed to be, uh, you know, a Diablo 4 reference? Or is this just, you know, your cosplay and, you know, you look badass and that's it? Grim Reaper's wife. Oh, okay. <laughs> the Grim Reaper's wife. I mean, I think they're doing a good job at that, actually. I think even though it looks very badass, it does look pretty feminine. Of course, because, you know, your character is... You know, it probably is a female, right? It's female, it's female body type, right? I think the pieces look nice. I think the weapon looks cool. I don't know. I don't know if I would go. Well, I mean, this, the problem with this weapon is that you're very green overall, and then you just have this weapon is very gray. Uh, I do think that you're going with a bit too. And I think this problem just continues happening. Is that you know the amount of balls that you have, the amount of infusions that you have. I don't think this fish infusion, the ghost infusion, goes well with this. You're green, not blue. Um, so I think that kind of conflicts with what you're trying to do here. I think that these weapons look better than the other one that you uh, showed us. I think the Adaban shoulders look not. I mean, no, Sun Reaper hands and shoulders look nice. I think the Decade one looks nice. I think the pants also look good. I think the backpack goes well. Everything else, everything, uh, the helm as well, beautiful. I just the ghost infusion and the balls don't 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 make it. You know, it's yeah, it's the issue. 
This is uh that is fucked up. <laughs> yeah, it's so fucked, bro. <laughs> I mean, look, you do look like Kobe Bryant. Okay, you you do. I mean, it. You no, know, the shoes. You know how tall you are. You know the pieces here. I like the uh, the the uh, Metal Legion uh, chest. I think I think that's good. Just look. Why did the fuck? Why do you come with a fucking helicopter, bro? That is fucked up. Okay, that is actually so ho that's so bad, bro. What the fuck? Oh man, that is that is just not, you know, that is that is unfortunate. Well, I guess you decided for it. no, did you did what? No, no, <laughs> that is not good. Look, the set is good, but you know the helicopter maybe, maybe not, maybe not so much. Okay. <laughs> All right, look, you were in the winner. Okay, you 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 know you got it. These are the top five EU players. It is. All right, here we go. So. Fifth place, gonna have to go to Cat Color. The Cat Rogue. Even though, this honestly, I think it's a better set than... Uh, I think it is a better set than Green Ripper, actually. I think it's more consistent. I think it's more chill. I think it looks better. better. But it is not trying to represent anything. And yeah, sure, the Green Ripper uh, wife, they just bring in with I'm the wife of Green Ripper. But, you know, they did have a backstory behind it. So I will consider that. And the effort sometimes... It's more important, especially on a, cos on, a, on a fashion contest with a theme like this. So, even though your set looks pretty cool, and I think you would have won very hard in a, you know, in a normal fashion contest, it still looks fine. So, there you go. Here is your big old good job. Next one is gonna go to, as I said before, the Green Reaper's wife. Because even though this set does look cool, I think the infusions are too, are a bit too much. The, you know, the aspect of it, the roleplay aspect of it is definitely there. It's not too much. It's not like it's an actual character. But at least, you know, you're trying to play with the whole, I am, you know, the wife of the Green Reaper, which I think I appreciate. So good job, nonetheless. Now, next one is going to go to the third place, which I guess you voted for, guys. With, and actually this surprises me. But you guys voted for third place, not a Stormwind Guard, but instead Slenderman. Actually, you know what? And, Oh man, you guys, I'm going to have to disagree with you guys here. I think Slenderman is better. It's better in terms of consistency because of the actual character. The Stormwind uh, guy does not really have a character here, guys. It doesn't. And you know what? I'm going to take over. I'm going to take over. I think I'm going to give third place to Stormwind Guard. Even though this set is better, I think this set overall is more cool, I guess. But the, the, there's no really Stormwind, Stormwind Guard uh, character, right? Uh, I mean, there is, but the Stormwind Guard is very chill. Like, this is Stormwind Guard. This is the guy, right? And he looks kind of like him, but this is like Stormwind Guard in fucking steroids, okay? This is the hero, okay? So, I mean, I, I think I'm going to have to go against your wishes, chat, and say that this is the um, third place. I'm sorry. The Stormwind, uh, the, uh, Stormwind is not good enough. And the Slenderman is. The Slenderman is perfect. I don't think you can do better than this. Maybe with the golden eyes, maybe, maybe. But I think all in one. Yeah, I think your set is very cool, though, Anderson. I think it's very good. And Slenderman, second place. non that's that is absolutely beautiful. And, of course, guys... Press place is gonna go to Kobe Bryant. Because <laughs> I mean, look, they 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 committed. They were like, "Yeah, it is fucked up, but I, you know what? I don't care. I'm doing the set, and it's gonna be perfect." And you know what? It is. They even fucking brought the fucking ball. They they came in the literal helicopter. Okay, like actually insane. Like you know, look, they they did it. They they did it. They, look, they risked it all, and they won. Good job, bro. They have the ball, they have everything. You deserve the win. And voted, and chatted, and chat voted for you. So, this is what it is. It is what it is. Good job. Good job. Now, it's time for an A. Maeva Wyrmfell. Maeva Wyrmfell. There's supposed to be a dragon, of course. It's almost like a duke. Like a dragon duke. It looks pretty cool though, I like the uh, pieces. 
I like the, honestly, I kind of like the Awakened Torch. I like the weapon. I like the colors as well. I like the shoulders. They really look like a, you know, a dragon that is like, you know, very wealthy. And they, they, they're like the, the mayor of a town or something. I haven't seen this kind of like, this kind of Drake uh, cosplay. So I, I like it. I think it's good. Ooh. Let's see. What is this? Ooh, this is scary. It's like a mad scientist. With both. I don't know. Maybe, maybe they need electricity. I like the scientific, that the scientist weapon, like the backpack. I am greatest best work warlock engineer of Planet Skyria. All Skaven fear, cleave my warp lightning. Warlock engineer of Clan Skaria. Who the, who is that? Clan Skaria. Oh shit, that's cool. So you are cosplaying it, damn. Oh, you're like total Warhammer. Oh shit, you're like a little rat, like a scientist rat. That's so cool. That is actually a very good set because you are Char, you actually do, and because you have the mask as well, you do look like a uh, like one of these characters. Yeah, it's a uh, Skaven Warlock Engineer from Warhammer. That's awesome. Very good job. Very, very good. Next one, we have the Blessed Mother, Lilith herself, escaping from the dawn game, the Diablo Forest, to replay a real game and not be associated with uh, with them. It's in. It's right here. With honestly a very good set, I really like the tattoos. I really like the skin, the color of the skin, the textures of the skin, the shoulder pads. Ooh, beautiful. Um, I really like everything here, to be honest. The helm works very well compared to the Lilith one, uh, Lilith uh, Diablo Four. Look at that. The helm is very similar because yeah, she has horns, but this set looks like she has like that. Does is not a helm. That's just part of her head. You know, the backpack, of course, perfect as perfect as well. Uh, the pieces very like scary, and the dice very work pretty well as well. On oh, oh, look at that the uh, the dagger from the new pa from the new patch. Uh, I forget. It's not abomination. It's cryptus, right? Uh, it's a crypt set. The cryptus set. I think it's absolutely beautiful. All right. Ooh, and just next to Lilith, we have Torelia in Arius. Yeah. Former Archangel of the High Heavens and Creator of Sanctuary, I seek what you have. Yeah, bro, look at the back. Uh, so, good job. I mean, I think the weapon also looks uh, pretty close to what he actually, you know, what you would usually have on him. And he does have a spear indeed. I think, yeah, no, I think this I think this looks nice. I think it looks okay, uh, for sure. I, I just think the pants, I think the pants gonna, because it's so black here, and you're so white and gray in the other parts, may is a die problem. I think that kind of like makes you like, ooh, what, what's happening there? But look, I think overall, it looks okay. Next one, let's see. Oh, Isaac Clark from Dead Space. Yes, okay. Dude, that is cool as well. It, it's perfect. And you know what? I was gonna say, oh, the, you know, it's usually kind of blue, but I'm guessing that this is the closest weapon that you can get to this. And it does have green on it. And you know what? That's okay. You know, I'm not gonna judge you. I'm not gonna, you know, give you a hard time because this green doesn't, um, you know, it doesn't die up. It doesn't perfectly match with the blue that this character obviously has in the rest of his set. Uh, obviously, that's gonna happen. I really like it. I really like the scrapper helm. I really like the uh, chest from, um, I think it's the heavy ops chest, right? I'm pretty sure it is. What is that hat? What is that hat, actually? And heavy ops uh, boots as well. Then just some random pants to, you know, make it look like, you know, the character actually is. Because the, the character does indeed have pretty chill pants, right? Definitely top five for this. Very, very good cosplay. Very, very good set just by itself. And, you know, putting the cosplay at the top of that makes it way better as well. Good job. Next one. Um, guys. Very, very good set here. Ooh. Actually, I think, look. You do look like gods. You do. You know, Guts does look like him. You know, you have the helm. I mean, you have the, the hair. You have the uh, great sword, of course. You have the shoulders that do look pretty similar to that. Look at that. Those look those shoulders. They look pretty similar. The spear marshal uh, chest to, you know, simulate that, you know, opening of the chest. Uh, and of course the gunslaver hands because he does have like this um, kind of like mechanisms in, in his hands because he kind of lost no well, spoilers for Berserker. Uh, well, 
but for Berserk, but you don't, he does lose one of his hands. So one of them you can you can use it as a tool, so in order to present that. And of course the great sword, uh, you know the Dragon Slayer great sword. Ekim of the Weast. Of the Weast. Is this I mean this does look pretty interesting. Ben Carmine from Gears of War 2. Alright, let's see. I mean this guy looks pretty awesome. But oh but why do you have green on it? Is this a spoiler? Did happen did something happen with this character that he becomes greenish? And then he dies or some shit? And I just don't know about it. Cause this seems intentional. He has everything here perfectly, you know, with the blue and the armor just like this character has right here. But then everything is green on the chest. I feel like he died or something. Bath of Benjamin Kerman. Oh. Yeah, that is... <laughs> that is fucked up. He gets me he gets melted by a worm. Did you he even brought the worm, bro? Oh my god! I mean, look, great job, bro. Like, I don't know what to tell you. This is absolutely great. Fuck, that's actually good. That's fuck. Okay, good job. <laughs> Nectavius. Is he supposed to be uh, Doctor Octavius, but greenish instead? But you know, Doctor Octavius does have eight. You know, there's only two, I guess. He does have the glasses. Is he even blonde? I mean, he's kind of blondish, I guess. A little bit. I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad, but I don't know. I don't know if it goes, you know. I mean, he's kind of greenish, I guess. But I think you could have done a bit of a better job, especially with uh, things like... Um, yeah, I think the colors could have been a bit better. And, uh, and you could have used the special ops pieces or whatever to make it look like more, you know more scientific or whatever. I don't think it's the worst thing. You know, I'll look, I'll give you, you know, two gold for um for effort. I don't think it's I don't think it's that bad. Monkey King looks very good. Is this Su Won? I mean Su Won. Wukong from the new Wukong game guys? I mean it is cosplay. Like like let's be real guys. Here you could you could argue that this is cosplay. I mean the Wukong has always been like a mythical creature. If someone came in here with like a Z a Zeus um, cosplay, we would allow it. Okay? And this set is absolutely... They even have the cloud! Because I don't know if you guys know, but Wukong, it does ride this cloud. This is where, um, Son Goku, um, you know, Goku, you know, he rides a cloud. He also, you know, he's kind of inspired from this, from this, uh, I think it's Asian character, I guess you could say. Very good set. Insane. Bjorn Herald. Ooh, wow. Oh, from Scarlet Monastery. Harold Scarlet Monastery. He does kind of look like him, actually. It must. It does look like that, actually. Yeah, no, you're right. Although, if that is the case, you should have, you know. Why, why, why do you not have your chest, uh, you know, just showing? That's my question. Because he does, you know, he shows his chest. He's like, I'm so badass. I don't even give a fuck. I don't need armor on my chest. He does look exactly like him, though. Look, the shoulder pads, actually. You know how they have the little bone on the so on the side and nothing on the other side? Exactly like this. I guess they do have this part. But it works perfectly as well. I like it. I think it's a very cool uh, very cool thing. Uh, so, yeah. I like it. I think it's good. Oh, I think they're in squad. I think the other sets are better. I'll just give them an all mention. These are the top 5 NA players. I'm just gonna do it right now. Top five. Gears of War 2. You are indeed number five. I think your set is actually very cool, but the competition, bro. You got fucked today. I'm telling you right now. You got fucked. Because this competition is hard. And uh it is what it is, you know, it is what it is. Your set is cool, your RP is very cool, but sometimes sometimes you lose. You look very awesome though. Very good job. Uh, I really appreciate it. Very, very good job. Fourth place is gonna go to Total War Harmer. I honestly think, I'm not gonna lie, uh, what's his name? I think you got me because I don't think a lot of people know what where this comes from. Uh, I think this, I mean, I don't, but I think honestly the combination of everything that you did here is absolutely beautiful. I think the thing with cosplays is that people see them 
vote for the ones that they really like because they like the characters in themselves. I think that's where you got fucked. Uh, but you know what? I think your set is absolutely great. So I don't give a fuck, okay? Uh, honestly, I would have gotten you in top two. Third place is gonna have to go to... And this is when you guys are gonna delete me. I'm not gonna give it to Wukong. I'm gonna give it to Dead Space. Because even though your set is absolutely beautiful, and it's perfect, and it's great, Wukong is better. And it's not my Slytherin who's better as well. So, very good job. You look awesome. Um, and you did a great job. You even brought the grenades. I saw it, like, like while we were judging those, um, the other ones. I saw that you brought grenades, because apparently this character just picks picks up different things and this is apparently a, an L gun so it kind of works out I think it looks awesome great job great great job third place you deserve it second place and it's not easy but it's gonna go to the blessed mother I love this set I think they did a great job here I think they did but we have seen Lilith before maybe not as good as this one but I don't think this is the original very, 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 very good sets. And you know what? Look. You are winning some gold. So, you know? You can you can use that for whatever you want. I think it's a great set. Very good job. Very, 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 very good job. The top one. And I think it's uncontested. It's just the Wukong. Wukong is just... It's just perfect. Like, the way that they made a char look like an actual monkey is just not... One, not easy. And two, it works perfectly. Using this helm to make it look more like a monkey as well. Using the pieces from the actual uh, festival as well. Like the backpack. And made the backpack be the, you know, with all the scores that it has. Because it has orange, it has red, it has green, it has this little bluish green. It has the gold. And everything, every die is inside of this here. And all the pieces from different pieces from different sets in different expansions. I mean, you just cannot get better on this. This is honestly one of the most perfect sets I've ever seen, and I think they deserve the win. And taking it and winning against Lilith, you know, that you see here, that made honestly a great set, it is not easy. So, very, you, very good job. You deserve it. Absolutely banger set. There it is. Beautiful. Good job, guys. Now, the best of both regions will fight against each other to get one real winner from one region. And here we have it, the top 5 NA versus top 5 EU, you know, to decide on who is the actual, which one is the best in fashion of the two regions. And we have first Koi Brand against the Dragon, the Koi Brand won instantly there, I mean, people really like that one. Uh, even it was very, <laughs> it was a bit questionable, <laughs> the people did like that one a lot for the creativity. Uh, then we had the Rogue versus the guy from Gears of War. And of course, the Gears of War was so, so, so very good. It just instantly wins. And actually wins against Kobe Bryant too. Very interesting here. I did not expect that as people really like that one. But this was, this one was very well done. Even with the roleplay from the actual character and how they die. So very good. We also have the Alliance uh, WoW character versus the one in Dead Space. But Dead Space, win Dead Space wins. We also have the uh, guy from uh, you know Slenderman versus the guy from um, Warhammer. Uh, the rat, the poison rat, and the uh, poison rat wins. But then, the poison rat, which honestly was a very cool transmog, you know, ends up fighting with the dead space uh, protagonist, and the dead space wins. They, after that, we have, and this is kind of sad because all of these ones were very, very good, and I think they would, could have been in the finals. We actually got the uh, guy from um, Gears of War versus the dead space guy, uh, Isaac, and Isaac wins in. To the finals on the right side of the bracket. On the right side of the bracket, we have Diablo 4 Lilith versus just, I mean, the uh, the um, Grim Reaper's wife. And uh, Diablo 4 uh, Lilith wins, considering, well, I mean, it makes sense it's from an actual game, uh, more of an actual cosplay. And uh, they did it pretty well, so they definitely win there. Uh, but then Diablo 4 Lilith fights against, honestly, one of the best ones here. Wukong and they had they didn't have a chance the, the all of the points were for here and then they just instantly get into the final because there was no more people in this bracket and at the end with the uh, you know Isaac versus Wukong and both from NA by the way EU was kind of deleted here uh, very very fast honestly the one that, the one from EU that really made it far and it didn't even made it that far was actually Koi Brandt and they just got deleted even before the semi-finals so 
not very, you know. EU, sadly, again this week, doesn't seem to be winning. And of course, the winner actually is Wukong, as honestly, it's such a good uh, fashion that honestly is one of the best we've had in the whole uh, of this fashion contest overall. So very good job, everyone. Very, very cool. And it wins again. So you, you have to come in next week, the Dragon uh, Fashion Contest. Uh, in order to hopefully win, because, you know, EU is getting deleted. It's just getting cleaned out. EU needs to come back in, okay? But thank you very much for watching, guys. Definitely come to our fashion contest Saturday, 10 a.m. EST, to have fun, some fun together, okay? I think it's very cool, and everyone can join us a little bit of gold and have fun with us. So, definitely have a good one, guys. See you guys around. Love you all. Subscribe to the channel. Bye-bye.